<laughs> that was either amazing Looks or like rain. <laughs> really, Geralt? You just killed the biggest monster in all of Velen, and you're doing a weather report. Now is the time of the sword and axe. None will fight this war in our stead. Nigh is the time of madness and disdain. We're back with our favorite Witcher and Weatherman. And, um... I just realized that, unfortunately, when you save a game before uh, looting a corpse, when you come back to that game, the corpse is gone, and there's nothing to loot. So, Geralt gets no reward from the corpse of the elemental, the earth elemental. And there was kind of, uh, that's really unfortunate. Let me see if he's on the, uh, in the bestiary, just out of curiosity. Um, elemental, earth elementals. What does it say to use? Demerinium bomb and elemental. Oh, okay. Pretty straightforward stuff that I probably already knew. Um, there was really no... What was the point of engaging that monster other than Geralt's ego? Not much. So, um, especially if we didn't loot the damn corpse. Have to keep that in mind in the future that um, the spoils of the kill go away in between uh, saves and loads. That's really, really unfortunate. I would have liked to have seen what would I, I would have gotten from him. And it's um, probably stuff that I'm going to need for crafting in the future. So that was just a big blunder. They should... Um, you know, I know I should loot before I save, but, you know, that's probably a fix they should work on in the future. Anyway, there's this that we get to uh, loot. Lesser Murana Runestone, Oil, and Florins. Okay. Now, um, we have got one more stage to this. Yes, one more stage to this uh, treasure hunt and quest. So let's see where it wants to take us. It wants to take us way up north, doesn't it? So, wow, that's like, uh, we want to fast travel to Yantra, I guess. So let's get to, let's get to the Dragon Slayer's Grotto fast travel post and fast travel to Yantra, right? And which is the, which direction do we want to head in here? We are looking kind of southeast. We want to turn to the left and look kind of uh, northwest. I don't know. We want to put this, we want to go this way. Geralt is like a bear. He just goes in a straight direction, regardless of what's in front of him. Wading through the uh, pond, rather than running around it. I suppose we can harvest on the way. Oh, you know what I need to do too? I need to meditate. Definitely need to meditate, because I used a ton of bombs, I used a ton of potions, and uh, yeah. Let me see if I'm still headed in the right direction. Eh, I'm going to make a little bit of a right turn. A little course correction there. Whoops, what do we have to harvest there? Hellebore petals. Okay. Also keeping in mind that we could run into the Leshen, could we not? This is Leshen turf over here. Um, I'm wondering what those uh, Witcher Sense blurbs are ahead. Hopefully just Endriga and not a legend. Those are... Those are Endriga. Okay, so Selendine, Endriga, Worker. Let's get Insectoid Oil on the Silver Sword. And that's... Where is the Insectoid Oil? Cursed Oil, Insectoid Oil. There you go. And um, get Quen up. Get Igni ready. Take the silver sword out and get ready to fight. Yeah. Another one stepping caught. Geralt is caught in the tree branch. That's good. Okay, so 
Well, they're gone. There's another one behind me here. I might as well take care of that one. Oops, stamina, not in 20 L mode. Oh, dear. Let's take that one out just to get the stamina. Oh. Okay. That should be all the Endrigo, right? Lesser green mutagen. Lesser blue mutagen. Lesser blue mutagen. Okay, so we're sort of away. And now I'm all turned around once again. And I need to make a an extreme right turn. Another Endrigo creeping up on us there. Okay, now we're done with all the bugs. That's a blue mutagen. Okay, there's a lot of stuff to harvest right there, isn't there? Or, I think there is. Cortinarius. And what did I say? I was going to say not long groove. Not long groove. <laughs> Don't know what that does for me. Just somehow uh, satisfies my aggravation that I can't find long groove. On fiber. Am I... I? This hill looks somewhat familiar, but. Let me just, yeah, this is the hill that the fast travel post is on. There it is, dead ahead. Okay. And now we will fast travel the Antra. All right. I'm back in the Antra. I had uh, some pretty frustrating times in this town, if I remember correctly. Could whistle up roach, but I'm not going to because we're going to harvest on the way here. Head through the sunflowers, get caught in a mud puddle. A lot of arenaria up in this area, if I remember right. So it's not a Terrible idea to do some harvesting. And of course, it's all going to be. What am I hearing? I'm definitely hearing a dragon. Okay. Do I care? Is that we've we've just got done killing a really powerful monster? Do I want to get involved with another one? Um. Hmm. Of course, I don't know yet, but it's. Extremely powerful. I have a vague memory of running into something that was way out of my league the last time I was in this area, but uh, that's a vague memory. Glow ball. Honeysuckle. It's almost aware of me. Moly arrow. Mandrake root. What do we got here? Level-wise. Can I get a level from it? It's going after sheep. Okay, that's very interesting. Okay, so I think this is in my league. Let's um, let's get Draconid Oil on the Silver Sword. And let's... Uh, you know what I should do? I should repair the Silver Sword again. Spectre Oil, Cursed Oil, Insectoid Oil, Necrophage Oil, Hangman's Venom, Hybrid Oil. I've got regular stinky Draconid Oil, huh? Okay, let's get to our repair kits and waste one of those on the Silver Sword. Definitely ready for it. And I forgot to meditate. 20th level. Okay, sword out, Geralt. Sword out, Geralt. I press the button for the sword out. I know you like to be at a dead stop to do anything, but Gwen and uh, Ard. Probably take 20 hours. Uh, oh, that hurt. Let's take 20 hours. Nope, that's. Now I definitely have to uh, meditate. Get out of there before you get whacked again. You don't have Quen up. Oh, that's what you get. Alright, let's see if we can get a Quen bubble thing going. Where's it going now? Is it going after sheep? Now, going down. You, I think. Let's see if 
we can do that again. Nope, it's flying away. Now, um, what happens if it comes at us? Thank you. That's what I was looking for. Regular Quen. Definitely getting in battles I don't need to get into. Oh boy. Quen up. Into dodge, because it's definitely about to attack. Hard. No, hard, hard. Oh boy. Okay, Quen Bubble, like I was saying. Okay, come on, don't go after the sheep. Come after me. I've got Quen Bubble up. Cat, please. Really? Okay, thank you. Oh, really Quen up. Effect. Hard ready. Dodging. Coming to kill. Dodging. Twenty hours. There you go. Huh? Okay, got it. Now, loot the corpse before you save. Lesser green mutagen, monster bone, monster feather, cockatrice stomach, cockatrice egg. Did I need a cockatrice stomach for something? I may have. And uh, I think I'm noticing a few dead sheep over here that we're going to loot. Yeah, he's doing another number on the herd. So the local farmer should... Oops, it looks like I uh, spoke too soon there. Did a number on the local farmer, didn't it? Okay, this is why the world needs witchers. Oops, I thought that was, uh, <laughs> there's the Arenaria I've been looking for. Okay, um, that is, is that, that's, what is that? That is, uh, Temple Isle? That I'm like, yes, Temple Isle that I'm looking at. Okay, so, I didn't realize Temple Isle had a tower that tall on it. That must be the, the, um, Eternal Fire or, uh, temple or cathedral, right? That Temple Isle is named after? I guess if it's a cathedral, it'd be called Cathedral Isle, wouldn't it? Mandrake Root. Another one I don't see too terrible often. Where is a good place to meditate before I forget again and um, get involved with some other creature? Let's put our back to this little hill here and uh, kneel here and meditate for a little bit. Okay, so we should have all of our bombs and potions back, and it looks like we do. Very nice. Okay. And the weather has cleared a little, or at least the sun has peeked around the clouds after meditating. Some bigger tick blossoms here, yes. Genadia petals and some kind of creatures up ahead. Probably drowners because we're getting close to the shore, aren't they? Um, it's worth it to engage them. Let's um, get necrophage oil on the silver sword. That's vampire oil, necrophage oil. Nope. And uh, take that out. Get Quen ready. The reason why I say that is because I remember... No, they're regular drowners. Never mind. But anyway... I've started the what now, you started to engage them, so we're gonna just go ahead with it. Oop, dodge girl, because you're about to get attacked from behind. Quinn is down, Quinn back up. Eat me ready, dodging. Okay. Strong attacks because I've been <laughs> fighting big monsters. Don't think you need strong attacks with them. You do need to hit them right when they get them up. Oh. Oh, if I die to drowners, that's going to be really embarrassing. 
So only one of them has um, anything to loot, drown or tone. Okay, so are they guarding treasure or something around here? Probably not. What am I hearing? I'm hearing Endriga. Genadia petals. Hopefully that's just like a... No, it must be those guys off in the distance. All right, I'm going to ignore them. Don't need to engage them. And generally speaking, they don't engage you. They're not like wolves that don't hunt you down. <coughs> Excuse me. Monster den. Okay, maybe I do need to engage them. All right, well, I guess that's where I'm going. Down there for my... Uh, quest. Uh, I didn't want to go. I wanted to harvest whatever was up on the hill here. Hump, hop umbles. That was almost a very unfortunate... Um, Mispronunciation, wasn't it? Why am I going after Buckthorn? There's really no reason. I'm like a like a moth going after a flame. Okay, do we have a we have a fast travel post now here? Okay, very nice. There's a boat there in case we feel like going sailing. Alright. Um before I head in, I get does it does it look like I have to head in or do I have to the quest marker is just very strange. Alright, well before I do anything, I'm gonna take a minute and save the game. Okay, where do we want to go here? Are we still a little bit confused by the mixed messages on my mini-map? Oh, I see. It's just, it wants me to look at that first. Okay, got it. <laughs> Always got to look for that first, don't we? This is an interesting little cave, is it not? What do we have up ahead? Okay, I guess I'm going to have another chance at uh, looting an, an elemental. <laughs> Let me try not to blow it this time. <clears throat> what kind of ele- uh, I assume it's an earth elemental. And what do we got over there? That doesn't- does that look like the same thing we fought? No, that's a golem. Alright, um... Nonetheless. Um, we need to worry about uh, looting it before we save. Okay, so, uh, inventory. How's my sword looking? Hmm, that's all right. Let's um, get elemental oil on um, the silver sword. And let's get quen up. Sword out. And I guess we'll go with art again. That seemed to work pretty well against uh, Earth Elemental. That is going to be tough too. I do want to use bombs against them. No, but I do want 20 out. To help with that stamina regeneration. Dodging, dodging. Do I? Yes, I have quite out. Let's refresh it. Down. Dodging, 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 all the dodging. Parting. Oh, this almost is tough. Alright, so let's look at what do we want to. Let's look at. Uh, does it say Dimeridium Bomb as well for these? Um, elemental. Columns. It wants dimeridium bombs and elemental oil. Okay, so let's get into inventory here. Let's keep Samum, but let's replace Grape Shot with dimeridium bombs. So put that where Grape Shot is. Nice. And uh, let's. Um... Oh, we got it. That was not going to work, was it? At all. Camera all tangled up with us. Okay, now let's try it. Now let's... Get out. Why are you not? Because I don't have it selected, that's why. There you go. No, I didn't like that, did you? All right, Quen refreshed. Ard ready. Dodging. Now, is it technically nighttime and... Now is going to last all night. Where's that? Oh, 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 
whoa, 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 no, 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 no! Why didn't Ard work? What the heck was that? Ugh. Okay. Can you help me with a Quen Bubble shot? What the hell just happened there? Why did Quen Bubble go down? What is going on with my side? Dodging, because uh, he's probably going to. That's much better. <laughs> Strange things happening with the sun. That's all I'm saying. Okay, regular Quen up. I definitely arted him as he was charging at me, and it just. And I had the stamina for it. No, it just doesn't work when he's charging. Got it. Alright. Alright. So don't ard when he's charging. Not a good idea. Dodge down that. This is probably going to get to the end of the Quen bubble and crush you. Okay, regular Quen. I. But I still don't think that um, Ard even really triggered. But, um, <clears throat> so I just didn't see the effect happen. I didn't see anything come out of Geralt's hand. Oh, here we go again. Alright, so we need Quen Bubble up again. Thank you. You're going to do that one more time, I hope. Without charging. Nice. We're gonna hit you with another Dinoridium Bomb. Why is Geralt getting hung up on little tiny rocks under his feet? What is that? Mm -hmm. Charge. Regular Quen. Ard. Dinoridium Bomb. Nice. Yeah. Pulling the Ard trigger for some reason. Oh, that's the aura, I guess. I guess it was too close. It didn't seem like I was that close to it, but whatever. I guess I was. And maybe that happens to Maybe when he's affected by the Dimeridium Bomb, he cancels Geralt's uh, sign ability. There's a little rock there that he gets hung up on. Really annoying. He's charging, and I'm not getting out of the way for some reason. Okay, there we go. There we go, how do you like that? Now, I'm gonna get out of the Dimeridium Aura. You. Mentality back. Hope. Oh my god. There is definitely some kind of, What is going on? I'm, oh, I'm gonna die more than thing again. I'm just going to die here from being a bozo. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Clapping your hands together. Can you just give me some... Like, you missed. That was pathetic. Thank you. We're gonna have to do that about 50 more times. Oh, dodging, dodging, dodging. Shouldn't be that hard. I mean, I know he's tough, but I'm just making a lot of stupid errors here. Unforced Witcher errors. Hard <laughs> uh, ready. Dodging, because I know he's charging. Oops. Not what I wanted to do. Switch to Samum. Select that. Let him have it. We're going to hit him with a couple, I think. It's just going to stand up there. Might as well unload our salmon uh, supply on him. He's going to stay up there. Okay. So what else do we have? Let's just <laughs> unload our... Let's get uh, Dancing Star going. Um, where is that? That's Superior Dancing Star. What are you? You are Superior Moon Dust. Devil's Puffball, Grape Shot, Northern Wind, Freezes Foes, Blows Landed on Frozen Foes deal additional damage. Let's try that. Freeze him some more, even though he's pretty much frozen in place. 
Okay, so what do we got selected here? We got Northern Wind, let's go with Dancing Star. This is like the biggest cheat ever. Cheapest. Oh, no, he didn't like that. Not at all. Okay, coin up. And uh, Ard ready. Dodging wherever the heck he went. Now I think we want Northern Wind, now that he's out of his little pouting corner. when he's charging, just get out of the way. Really short. There we go. Alright, hard again. Does he have a hole in his stomach? Looks like he does. I don't know why I'm worried about that now. Alright, nice. He got out of this northern wind freeze. Charging, and I had a bomb ready to go, except the controller was not responsive. Alright, let's freeze him. Where did he go? That's a neat trick. Are you coming out of there? Um, what do I do about that? Okay, is he gonna come this way? How do I... Are we out of... Alright, so I'm going to be able to interact with that, right? Apparently not. Okay, can you come back? What the hell do I do here? Interact. Okay, now he's going to attack me. That's not going to be good. Okay, here, I'll stop playing around with that thing. Alright, um, what up? That's definitely odd. blows up or something. You're gonna be like a rot fiend or something here and blow up on me and uh, kill me that way or something because he's so big he's like a giant rot fiend with a giant explosion. Okay so now we want to, what do we want to do here? We want to loot him obviously before we save but um, do I not have a loot thingy? Is there nothing to loot? Really? You gotta be kidding me. Really? I guess golems, golems are like drowners. They just don't have anything. All right. Well, he's got plenty to loot over here, I suppose. Why am I hearing, I'm hearing Andruga. Oh, because they're up, they're like over my head. Okay. Swarog runestone, amber dust, specter dust, cotton, master weapons repair kit. Nice. Probably should repair my weapon again. Uh, Journeyman's Armor Repair Kit. Looting the wrong things. Feline Steel Sword Superior. Nice. Okay, so Swarag Runestone, Amber Dust. Uh, empty Bottle. Quest Completed. Scavenger Hunt. Cat Skull Gear Upgrade Diagrams Part 3. Alright, so that's all of them. Dark Iron, Silver. Ducal Water. Loot. Uh, Journeyman's Armor Repair Kit. And is that everything? That's everything over here. Let me take a minute and save the game. Okay, everything over here looted. Still aggravated that he doesn't have anything to loot. Maybe he left it in this other chamber over here. And there's not long groove there to uh, harvest. <laughs> Just going to stick with that because uh, more not long groove. More not long groove. No. So. Just you can't find any long group. What's up with that? And I thought there would be more attacking me in this chamber, but thankfully no. Bear fat, allspice. Okay. Empty bottle, Genadia petals, ducal water, winestone, burbicane fruit. Winestone, burbicane fruit. More stuff to loot. Allspice, celandine. That's everything over there, right? Oops, we've got corpses. Alchemist Notes. Axman's Trousers. Lesser Zoria Runestone. Let's read the Alchemist Notes. 
Jester had one task, one. <laughs> you had one job, Jester. To write incantations on the ribbons used in creating the golem. And what did he do? Made a dog's dinner of it, of course. And as a result, instead of a guard, we have a murderer walking our lab. And I asked, did you double check the incantations? Oh, I, yes siree. Are you sure? Sure as shooting, I. And yet the results prove otherwise. To think that I could have had one of my students do it instead of that imbecile. We've barricaded ourselves in, but he'll get us. Yeah, he sure would, because he walked right through your barricade, I think. It's only a matter of time. At least I can dull the horror of my last minutes with fist tech. Prime quality stuff at that. We would have garnered top coin for it had Jester not been a complete and probably illiterate idiot. Well, I guess I didn't have many years left in me anyways. And better to go out with a bang than die slowly in a hospital. So I suppose it's Valfell Crew World. I guess that's that must be some kind of uh, elven saying, or maybe it's uh, dwarven saying. I don't know. Okay, so that's um, the end of these guys. What were they doing with them? Tor tier tor tier to care blade. Yeah, I'll get that right one of these times. Greater Strabag runestone. Greater glyph of Quen. Coal, Iron Ore, Glory of the North, Assassin Boots Relic. Okay, good stuff in here. Powdered Pearl, Alcohest. Powdered Pearl, Ranagrin. Wasn't there another one? Yeah, there was another one too. Print Grape, Allspice. And I put out something. Okay, that's everything here, right? Let's see what we got there. And it is definitely time to see a blacksmith and an armorer. Tear Torquer Blade. Okay, we're selling that. I'm getting a nice uh, amount of coin for it, hopefully, too. What do we have here? We have Steel Sword, Glory of the North. It would boost me up five, but as we compare it, it would, um, it would knock down my uh, armor piercing and everything. And it's uh, not worth it, so we will sell that as well. And, um, yeah, we've got some greater glyphs now. Greater glyph of Quen. And didn't I get... Uh, I got another one. What was the... Got like a... Why is it not showing up? Where the heck is it? I'm pretty sure I got another greater... Oh, no, it was a, it was a runestone. It was a greater runestone. Okay, never mind. It was greater Strabag or something like that. Um... It was a greater runestone, whatever it was. Okay. Greater Zoria runestone? No, I don't think so. I think it was that guy right there. Nope. Greater Vel... Uh, whatever. It was a greater runestone. Okay. So, once again, that is the end. Look at that. I don't even have a... Uh, don't even have an item for um, treasure hunts now. So, begging the question here... What do I do now? It seems like I go back to Novigrad and start diving into some of these quests. Um, and the Gwent tournaments are going to be one of them as well, I think. So let's see if we can get to uh, Novigrad, get to an armorer and a um, blacksmith, lighten our load, and not forget to sell Roach's stuff as well and go from there. So let's do that. Let's head to Novigrad. Is there another? There's an offshoot to this. What am I looking at here? Why is there? Why is it showing me? What the heck's going on here? Why is it showing me a cable this way? And what's with those like runes etch, etched into the cable? Is it worth it to do an ARD? Ah, wasn't showing up in my Witcher senses, though, as something that I could ard. That was a sneaky trick. I wonder if um, the two dead guys put some kind of, like, magic whatever hex on it so I couldn't... Interesting. Skellige Gambeson. Iron Ore. Dimeridium Ingot. Which we now know is pretty uh, um, valuable. Dark Iron Ingot. Resin and ruby dust. For all of that hiddenness there, that was kind of crappy. I thought there would be something more exciting in there. All right. Anyway, we've got all the uh, Witcher school diagrams that we can get. And we're going to take a boat 
unfortunately it's like 9 p.m. And by the time I get there, all of the, uh, we're going to have to go to Hattori first. So, um, yeah. Could I find a fast travel post down here? Could I just fast travel into, um, Novigrad? Could I make up that I found the fast travel post? I thought I got a fast travel post. Yeah, there it is. Over there. Yes, I did. We discovered the fast travel post. So, let's, um, let's fast travel to where? Where are we going to fast travel to? We're going to fast travel somewhere close to Hattori, and he's going to have, he's going to have money, right? Because I haven't seen him in ages. There's no excuse here, Hattori. Okay, fast traveling. All right, why is Geralt? Geralt is, uh, like, plodding along there. I want him to run. Okay, and Hattori is off to the right a little bit, right? And, um, like, around this corner, yeah. Still going to be a while before I can go to the armorer, isn't it? Did I just... I kind of went right past it, didn't I? He's over here. That's the beacon I'm looking for. All right, Hattori, it's been a long time. Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Geralt. How might I be of help? All right, um, let me see what you got. What do you have on offer? I suppose I should get rid of the expensive items first, shouldn't I? All right, I basically sold him everything, and um, he doesn't have any money left, or I would sell him all the roach stuff. I just, I didn't want to wait. I was hoping he had enough money to buy everything and lighten my load completely, because I don't want to wait for the armorer to wake up and open his shop. But, um, that didn't work out so well. So let's uh, have him some, repair some stuff, and then uh, maybe he can buy an item or two more after I give him some money back. Okay, this will repair. I'm not going to repair what we're going to sell. And this stuff probably really isn't damaged that much, but... Okay, so now he's got some gold. Oops, not what I wanted to do. What do you have on offer? Let's see what he can buy here. With 135 crowns, you can buy that, and I think that's about it. Okay, so there you go. Um, let's say farewell. So long. And now we start thinking about what's the next quest, because we're all out of those. Unless I, unless I'm feeling really brave and want to go uh, with these Witcher contracts, which are probably well above my level. Looks like we're into the um, looks like we're into the secondary quests, and I think it's Fist of Fury first. Um, it's a little above my level too. So is this uh, Gwent tournament. Um, there is what is there? There's um, no, that's Skellige stuff. That's Skellige stuff. I thought there was another soldier statuette. We kind of missed the boat on that one. Yeah, that one we definitely missed the boat on. Um, there's uh, this. I could get this off my list, but I hate horse racing. Um, and then there's, you know, these two political plots, which I still haven't really... Every time I think about them, I keep thinking, well, I just do the Dijkstra uh, because I hate... Uh, I like Dijkstra and I hate Radovid, but I don't think it's that easy. I think maybe... I don't know. I mean, I, I, I feel like I, I have to do this one first, just in case this one ruins that one. Um, I mean, I'm just telling him what I learned about Philippa, right? I'm not, like, delivering Philippa to him. There's that bit. Um, but if he takes that thingy from me, that power cell gem thingy, maybe he'll be able to go after Philippa somehow. All right, let's do this. Um, George is... Georg. Georgius Georg. Okay. So where is he in Novigrad and is he awake at this hour? 
Let's um, look at the world map here. He is like up the road. Okay, so let's go get our head caved in there. That's oh yeah, right. That's inside that um, that inn. And now I can't remember the name of it. Tavern, whatever it is. And I suppose when I get outside the inn, what I'll do is save the game. Where am I going? Am I going in the wrong direction? Uh, I'm, well, you know what? Do I want to go to my stash? Do I have anything to put in my stash? What do I have to put in my stash? Um, it would just really be this roach stuff that I would hang on for, hang on to for uh, sentimental value, wouldn't it? Um, no, there's no reason to go to my stash. I just went the wrong way. I'm like, oh, what's your bonehead? It's head back the right way. We can go at it here, towards my place. Uh, you these days. Air braid all. This way. <laughs> and we want to make a right turn up here, right? Now we've got Tony, Tony Al, so I should be able to run more because my stamina is regenerating, right? Oh, what do we got going on here? Are you kidding me? Bandits inside Novograd. How is that possible? Come up. Igni ready. Run back. Dodging, not in time. Run back up. Igni ready. Doing this without Hangman's Venom on the... Actually, I think I have something on the uh, Steel Sword. I don't know what it is. Okay, three less bandits bothering the streets of Novigrad. There you go. And then now they're going to bother my carry weight, but what are you going to do? All right, ham sandwich, mace, grilled pork, Novigrad longsword, and uh, I'm going to take a minute and save the game now. Okay, continuing to the inn. To get in a brawl. Hopefully not get uh, Carol's head caved in. Hopefully. Okay, let's talk to the uh, fight organizer. Master Claytop, is that you? I suppose so. If you've got the title Master... Master uh, Claytop heartily greets the challenger. Greetings to Master Claytop from Geralt. Will you take up the challenge? Will you face our tavern's champion? I'm ready to fight. Ah, uh, let's crank it up. Make it a, a yeah, juicy uh, purse. Oil, fellow. Your attention, please. This fine witcher has agreed to join in battle with our tavern's champion, Georges George. Georges George, that's how you say it. You and I should have a chat. Really? Let us talk coin. I shall be blunt. You stand to earn a great deal, provided you follow a few recommendations. You asking me to cheat? Not to cheat. To engage in an enterprise, that is all. What say you? Uh, no, I'm not going to cheat. <clears throat> because I have to complete this quest. Now, can you guarantee me that I'm going to be able to complete this quest? Then I'll cheat. <laughs> Let's not cheat. Kiss my ass, Master Claytop. <laughs> you will regret that. A warm welcome to our competitors. Besides, how much coin is he going to give us? Geralt versus George's George, the pile driver. May the better man win. Does look like a bruiser, doesn't he? Okay. Dodging. Staying in the circle. Come on, come closer. Boy, he gets his guard up quick, doesn't he? And that camera angle. Oh, Carol, you gotta swing faster than that. Okay, so let's go with 
Quick attacks. This is going to be tedious, isn't it? Okay, come on. He gets his... Damn. There we go. Got one in on him. Let's see if we can... He's a little slow with that blow, isn't he? So... That's the way to get at him. I think. Oh, he got one in on me. Damn it, and I'm stuck. And this is way too tight a camera space for me to... What the heck? You gotta be kidding me. That should just not happen, and now I'm stuck in the corner. Oops, and he's swinging on me, and the camera is definitely screwing me up. Got one in on him, I think. How did he block that? I kicked him in the back. I gotta try to get, uh... Oh, got one in on me, damn it. I guess so. Uh, camera screwing me up again. Okay, I can see him. You say so. Come on. What are you doing? on why are you not dodging what the hell is there that I'm hitting there's nothing there Let's end this. no you're dodging the wrong yeah. way that's Slow to the break. oh you were supposed to punch and you dodged oh got him I need him okay Boy, that that cam that tight space with the, the camera, the no, new not working. Is the Witcher called Geralt. Here is your prize. Yeah, and I didn't cheat. Archibald O'Neill is another brawler you can fight. You'll find him near the entrance to the slums. That's There's where I'm heading Mortimer, next. Captain of the guard. He can usually be found near the Oxenfurt Gate. Okay, and hopefully. Um, it's not such a tight space. Yeah, everybody's leaving. Oh, I guess the festivities are over, huh? Okay, let me see where am I headed here. He told me, but... Um, okay, we're headed back down toward Hattori. Okay, and this one, Archibald O'Neill. Do I remember seeing a fight ever going on down there? I don't remember seeing that. But, um, okay. Let's head down that way. We're running straight back the way we came. when you get in a fight. The all-night Tawny Al thing doesn't uh, apply. Okay. And I suppose it's for where... Where the heck am I headed? Oh, I'm headed down there. Okay. Alright, so before I get in this fight, it's worth it to save the game again. Archibald O'Neill. This is a tight space too, isn't it? Uh, I don't like these. Okay, so who's who do I who do I talk to here? Townsman. Any of them? Where's the guy in charge? So I'm gonna pass these guys. And Townsman, Townsman, Townsman. Archibald O'Neill. Do I want to talk to him directly? Name's Geralt. Patty Gruber. I'm a bookie. I trust you're here to fight. Yep, I'm ready to fight. And, uh, well, the stakes can't go that high for this I'm one. I'm ready. Hear that? A fight at last! 
our champion, Archibald O'Neill, to face Geralt. Nice hat. Fight. Archibald O. Acorn hat. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was, that got started quick, didn't it? Okay. Camera's a little better this time, but... Okay, that one was... What? Lost your nerve? Come on. Try to sneak one in before he is faster than the other guy. But I think he doesn't recover his uh, defenses as quick as the other. What's he doing? Hanging out with the other people over there? Oh, how did he dodge that? Carol does not load up the punch quick, does he? Come on. Come on. Probably just gonna attack me again. Oh. I've gotten a strong punch in there from that. Oh, that was ridiculous. Come on. Not too late to surrender. Don't like that area. Just don't like get caught there. I punched him in the back and got him. Whew, these fights are tough. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new champion. The man who dethroned Archibald O'Neill. Bravo. Archibald's looking downtrodden there. Want to be crowned the best in Novigrad. Who do I got to fight? Well, if you yearn to fight some more, you must certainly face the captain of the guard. I'm in. Okay. Only 25 experience points, huh? Uh, 100 crowns. Nice. All right. So he is... How far away is he? He's going to be over in the bits somewhere, right? Yeah, he's going to go all the way over there. Uh, i got to go past my stash again. Um, good news is it's almost time for the armor to be in the shop. So we will um, fight this guy. And then uh, head to the armor, hopefully, and get all of our carry weight woes taken care of. What was that? Concerned citizen sermon. Okay, that's just. Um, yeah, exactly. That's just uh, the vam weird vampire guys, the uh, coroner's notes, right? How many of those did he leave around? Okay. I'll miss a woman's touch. We are getting close here, right? And the captain of the guard is going to be awake at uh, like 3.30 in the morning, right? Go. go up these stairs. I guess. Yes. Okay. And once again, it's worth it to save the game. This should go easier because I've got a lot more room this time. Okay, now who do I talk to here? That guy looks important. There you go. Uh, bookie. There we go. Talk to the bookie. Don't talk to your opponent directly. Talk to the bookie. Wait, that's the same guy from the inn, isn't it? Are you going to ask me to cheat again? I'm ready to fight. Ah, this one we can crank up higher than the other one. Nice. I'm ready. Let's do this. Fight! Does he get to keep his breastplate on? What the hell is that? to keep his breastplate on. And yeah, and I gotta go the uh, no shirt team. What's he doing? What? 
lost your nerve. Well, I went through him. That was an interesting maneuver. And through him again. He kind of like dives at you. And you get an opportunity to like go right through him. Yeah, having a lot more luck when I can actually see what I'm doing and who I'm fighting. Doing too many dodges. Okay, what are you you're trying to dodge into him that time? Where are you looking? What? Am I making you turn around like that, or are you doing that? And once again, hitting an invisible barrier there. There's nothing there. What is stopping me from backing up? That's strange. Open area, so there's an imaginary barrier to close it up. Oh, get out of that. I am definitely oh, I'm running into those guys that time. <sighs> Some frustrating about these fights. Of Rivia dethrones Captain Mortimer. Behold your prize champion. You have earned the honor to challenge Novigrad's champion, Durden the Tailor. You will find him in far corners and fight there as well after sundown. After sundown, okay. 25 experience points, 190 crowns, and an update to the... Nope, I guess the quest doesn't go... Taylor for the Novigrad title. Okay, so where is he? He, um, and it's got to be after sundown. So is it even going to show me? Yeah, it's going to show me where he is. Oh, he's out there, um, kind of on the other side there. All right. So let's run to the armorer, and he's going to uh, going to be there, isn't he? Right? He's going to have a shop open. He is. I don't suppose I got lucky there. I should, probably should have been injured. Is that pig dead? No, he's sleeping. Okay. I don't know why I care. Where am I headed here? I headed in the right direction? I am really not. I gotta make a left turn to head over here. So, make that left turn. I don't know, part of Novograd I haven't been before. That's interesting. Okay, yeah, we wanna go not through. Oh boy. Okay, so some of them are still aggressive, some of them are not. Okay, fair enough. Let's get um, let's get some food on my sword. Apparently, let's get potions on my sword. Let's get uh, enhanced hangman's venom. Nice and uh, quite up. And I just guess I guess you guys are just never gonna get over it, are you? It's interesting. I've got some time to kill before I go to the armor, so you know, I'm happy to uh, indulge you guys. I'm an apathetic, so uh Okay. I'd say three less henchmen, but you know they're just gonna come back. Crowns, roasted chicken leg, mace, crowns, roasted chicken leg, mace, crowns, grow pork, mace. Okay, so you can put the sword away, Geralt. And you can head this way, I think. Yeah, so we'll head this way, we'll make a left turn. Head to the square, it'll be about oh, that same... <laughs> well, she's got a routine, I guess. I can say that much about her. All right, so I guess we got to go through this way and take that door. One drink of what I have, thing I piss me trousers. The maid will tend to read yet. Okay, is he going? He's going to be in a shop, right? He's going to be there, right? He's not there. Okay, well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go over here and meditate, because I do have some potions and some bombs that I need to replenish. So I'll take care of that.
Now he's, there he is. The elusive armorer. Okay. See how much coin he's got. He's got to have a full purse. Because I haven't been to see him in about as long Top as I, it's shorts. been since I've seen Hattori. Show me your wares. Show me what you have in stock. And... Uh, oh, you're just going to buy junk off. Oh, and, and the saddle stuff, right? And roaches stuff. So, there you go. Okay, my carry weight is looking much better, but it still seems like I could lose some stuff here. Probably have a bunch of hides and stuff that I need to get rid of. Uh, not really, though. Hmm. I don't know what's weighing me down, but my carry weight is looking a lot better. Say farewell to him. So long. And now I guess we wait till nighttime and uh, go fight the tailor. So what does Geralt do? In the interim, he could go to the bookseller here. Let's see. I may have some book copies I need to get away, get rid of. Um, so let's see if the bookseller is in. Ah, you're back. Yes, I am. Let me have a look. Let's see these books of yours. Okay, that's it for the copies, the extra copies of the book. Books. And um, say farewell to the farewell. bookseller. Now, um, is there anything we can do to waste time until the evening? Um, quests. What do we got here? Oh, could we go do that? <laughs> I don't, I guess, I guess I should just get that off my quest list, shouldn't I? Um, so let's select it. And it's so damn early in the morning that we can probably get there, fast travel there, fast travel back. And then it'll be time to uh, fight the uh, tailor and um, we'll get that off our quest list as well. Um, yeah, so let's fast travel to the Bagel Bud residence. And heading right over here to this fast travel post, right? All right, we want to head up this way, I guess. Looks like we're let's uh, head up the stairwell. It looks like we're headed for the stables, if I remember the layout on the Bagel Bud uh, estate here. Uh, no, we're headed for the. Uh, the bleachers, so to speak. Okay, am I ready for this? I guess I am. Talk Count de Louverton. Is that who I talk to, or do I talk to... Do I talk to... Sir, who do I talk to here? Is it somebody... I'll try talking to you. No, nope, it's not you. It must be somebody up in the bleachers. Uh, looks like him up there. Oops. How do I get up there? Really? Oh, it's over there. I see that. Okay, now I got it. No, I'm not ready to do this, Race Master, but. If you've coined for the rider's fee and a steed of your own, why not? Decide quickly, please. There's a race about to begin. I'm ready. I'm on a race. Grand, your name and the name of your steed. Geralt of Rivia, on Roach. Oh, good. That means my stamina is... Excellent. Uh, Your opponent, let me see... Higher now. Seamus Holt, astride Athos. Okay, let me see if I'm ready for this. On three, one, two, three, off you go! Run, Roach. What the heck did you just do, Roach, and why? So one would figure that my stamina is much better than his, or Roach's stamina, that is. Why is Roach? It seems like Roach wants to stop for some reason. And there's, there's no Roach just following the... Uh, the path is there, here. I 
his horse has to run out of stamina before Roach does, doesn't he? I mean, you would think. <laughs> Why am I not stopping? That was bizarre. Okay, interesting. I thought the race was still going on. Not bad. Yet we shouldn't kid ourselves. The competition was hardly stiff. Shall I sign you up for another? No. Maybe later. All I want to do is get it off my... Is this one of the for uh, so I could just keep gaining crowns? It's never going to get off my quest list. Is that what that is? Yeah. Okay. So that's just one of the I could do, I could do that forever and gain gain crowns that way. I have better ways of gaining crowns. I thought it would get off my damn list. All right. So anyway, or do I have to do it like five times and then it gets off my list? I don't understand. But it should tell me something. How many times I have to do it to get. Oh. <laughs> okay, that was a waste of time, but anyway, we we were looking to waste time. And uh, now we need to get back to um, Novigrad. Oh, it's only 7 a.m. What are we going to do? Let's see. Let's look at quests again. Um, I suppose I could start... Um, um, the, the Gwent Big City Players... I guess we could do that. Let's go back and do that. So let's head to uh, Novograd. Fast travel there. And see if we can get Vime Vivaldi's card. Right? Alright. Time to fast travel. Once again in the fast travel pen. Okay. Um, so what do I want to do here? I, I just, I'm assuming that I'm going to the bank to meet with him. But I don't, there's no real guarantee of that. Maybe when I play Gwent with him, he's somewhere else. Or I'm just going to follow my mini-map here. And it's going to take me right to him, right where I thought it would. Okay. Actually, I do have some coins to exchange, too, don't I? Is this going to automatically go into Gwent? Oh, the unfortunate arm thing. Convert some currency first. Got some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. You've come to the right place. A better rate you'll not find yes, anywhere in the uh, city. Yes, it's, uh, other places it would cost me an arm and a leg. To, but you, it's just two arms. Even when you're not in that, yeah, you just don't have arms. It's, I'm really sorry about that. I, which, there's probably people who could do something about that, actually. But I guess they just haven't been motivated to do anything about it. Okay, anyway. Let's talk to them. Once again, and we'll play Gwent, because they say you're not going to kick sense. in. Let's play Gwent. You play Gwent, don't you? Oh, sure. Because I'm a dwarf. Is that it? Do you also believe I know every other bleeding dwarf in existence, and at wow. the end of each day, I deepen the mine shaft in my cellar? So you play or not? Aye, I play. <laughs> Should we play down in your deepened mine shaft? Well, that, that came out wrong. That just... <laughs> <laughs> Should have thought about that utterance before I said it. All right, let's play around. So play me. Stake a unique card, maybe? Why not? Why is going to what the heck? Like, I would ever... All right, let's start the game. And I'm going to get a good deal here, right? What is he? He's Scoyatel. Okay, there we go. Decoy, Biting Frost, and that's Close Combat, uh, Zoltan, Medic, not a terrible deal, but I would like, at the minimum, I would like, there we go, we're looking for a spy. Okay, I'm going to be happy with that, there we go. Who goes first? Opponent's turn, okay. Mahakaman Defender, alright, there you go. And uh, let's give them Dijkstra. The All right, got um, what did I get? Oh, we got another decoy and um, Commander's Horn. Okay, we are going to pass. 
What's the Scoia'tael perk? Your opponent won the round. What what annoying thing does Scoia'tael get? <laughs> opponents are good. That's we like when it's the opponents are. Oh, say synthesis. And uh, no, I don't know how to pronounce that, and no, I never will. Okay, so we have to win this round, um, and we might as well. Um, should we save that for final round, or should we should we make it happen now? Um, hmm. Hmm. Let's. Um, you know this person has scorch. You just know it. Okay, what does this do? It's not. It's not showing up. Whatever it is that does. Um, hmm. I'd like to save him for the final round and use it in conjunction with that. Oh, I'm going to risk that he has Scorch. It's probably a bad idea, but I'm going to risk it. He passed. Okay. Well, um, that worked out nicely because I'm one point ahead. I'm going to pass. Thank you for that. You're really not going to use... Oh, well, you, you, you may not have gotten that. That spy, right. That spy went into your uh, discard. Okay. Well, that means that I use her twice and pull them out again. But uh, I'm planning on using that. So, hmm. All right. Let's see how this works out. They may clear weather. You never know. All right. So far, so good. Let's force the issue. And, uh, yeah. And so I, then I guess I want to work on my siege row. And uh, we'll go from there. Ah, I knew that would happen sooner or later. Okay. So with that being the case, um, let's decoy him. And... Thankfully, he's close combat, so... Yeah. Okay. It's got to be irritating that they're all going down to one. Nicely done, except I didn't need a close combat guy. Well, they're, all <laughs> uh, they're all going down to one there. Okay, so I have nothing but close combat in my... Um, discard. Let's start working on um, the siege row. Do I have any? Yes, I have yet. Okay, really. I picked the right weather card. I, I've got to say that much. Um, okay, so uh, let's go with another siege thingy. Of course, if he has Scorch, that's really going to ruin my day, isn't it? Now, if he has Scorch, he only gets rid of one. So, there you go. But heavy on the close combat, is he not? Okay, um, well, we gotta get rid of Siegfried sooner or later, so let's do it. Penetrable Fog. Uh, I don't I only have Yen. Is Something tells me you're gonna lose here, buddy. Um... Well, let's go for it. <laughs> Save that last decoy in case you have a uh, spy. And I thought you might do something like that, you tricky bugger. Okay, so you could have gotten Scorch. Let me do this. Oh, no, right, you just took Dijkstra back. <laughs> okay, got it. Uh, well, now you might have Scorch, is what I'm getting at, I guess. Yes, deploy him. What did you get? Did you, you'll probably get Clear Weather and Crush Me. Nope, Dendrable Fog. Well, that's a double up there, isn't it? Okay, Dijkstra again, and I get some more cards. Okay, Blue Stripes Commando. Nice. 
<laughs> You've got to be kidding me. Come on. <laughs> All right, put this down. Should boost them up to four. Wow, astounding four. Dang, struck <laughs> Oh, crap. All right, well, the thing is he could get a clear weather and really ruin my day, so. And I have clear weather, but I'm not going to use it. Because if I do, it's going to ruin my day. See what you got. Commander's Horn. Yeah, definitely cannot clear the weather now. All right, so let's put down a medic and pull out the uh, striped commando. What's your last card? It's going to be clear weather, and I'm going to be crushed. Nope. Unfortunately, it's all over for you, and I'm going to rub it in by using my leader card. Oh, you may have all the uh, crushed. I should own the bank now. Okay, let's pass. Okay, what did we get card-wise? And does that let us complete that quest, or is it going to tell us to play somebody else? So yes, you, you got thrashed. Yours. Tried your best. Tell me, who else would have worthwhile cards? There's Marquis Serenity, for instance. She don't boast about it, but she has one of the best decks in town and uses it damn well. I know what I'm talking about. Okay, quest updated. Vesemir, okay, nice. Now, can I add him to um, Northern Realms? Let's check that out. Or actually, he kind of automatically gets added or not, does he not? Yes, he does get added. Um, okay, now he's just a six, so that means that I get rid of a five or a four, right? And put him in instead. So let's get rid of, let's get rid of Siegfried and put Vesemir in there instead, right? Okay, nice. And um, yeah, that's what we want to do there. And I'll go ahead and save the game again. All right, so it's 11, it's like noontime. We've got time before uh, the big fight after sundown. Where is, where's our next Gwent opponent? She is Marquis, Marquis Serenity. Okay, so she's up kind of at the tip of Novigrad before you get onto Temple Isle. Let's head there. Oops, don't want to go into the tavern. We want to head this way. Wonderful. Sort of like the main drag in uh, Novigrad, is it not? This path or road or street or whatever. Okay, which way do I want to head here? I want to head this way, I think. And I'm going to go up those stairs into that building. Is that where she's at? Geralt, the oh, that looks like I, where, where am I going here? Oh, she is up there. Okay, let's see if we can get at her through this stairwell. This is an impressive building. What is this building? Oh, nope, not where we wanted to go. Oh, this is like some kind of hotel or something. These are like, they seem like, all right, where do we want to go here? Maybe she, maybe her entrance is down here. Uh, you woman, how do I get at you? Seems like you're in this building. Just try to enter it at the ground level. Maybe the upper levels are the wrong way to go about it. Ah, what is this? Is this another inn? A brothel? <laughs> Don't know what this is. Oh, God. What's the time? Oh. oh, quit complaining. Come on, I barely Sorry. bumped into you. Let's see what Geralt does to other people when he runs into it. Okay, so she's in. Now she's down below me. How is that possible? 
Okay, I think it's indicating that she's down below me. All right, so I've got to go down to the main room again and see if there's um, some way to get around down here. Okay. Let's see if we can get Geralt to pick up the pace here. Through this door, I guess. I should get a card just for finding her. Jeez. She's in the bath. Really? White wolf. Oh, okay. Welcome to the passive flora. Ah, that's what this oh. is. No sign of recognition in your eyes. Greetings. Uh... Don't fret. I'm sure I look quite different from when we last saw each other. Uh, which was? Oh, eons ago. You and Master Dandelion appeared, two halflings in tow. What a smash they were, the little chaps. We recount that night to this day. Yeah, sorry, but I'm here to... Speak softly. I know very well why you're here. Oh, no. This way, please. This way. Um, I Upstairs. got involved in the Deekstra quest. No. Die, okay, no, 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 no. We're supposed to play Gwent. No, no, Could no, no. That all roads lead to the passive flora? Welcome back. Hmm, when I look at you, why, I almost regret I'm no longer on active duty. Ah, thank the Witcher gods, if there are any. Actually, I think Geralt's an atheist, so I think I learned that from the book. He's at least an agnostic. Care for a game of Gwen? I'd like to see them first. Which girl would you recommend like to buy something? Um, we'll just get right to the Gwent here. I'm That's why curious. I came here. You play Gwent? Certainly. Though for high stakes exclusively, of course. In fact, the game would be exceedingly boring without the risk. Okay, there you go. Let's play. Up for a round? Why, yes. Let's play. Start game. Uh-oh. It's Nilfgaard again. Can't allow the tie. Okay, got a spy. That's good. Got two spies. Very good. Um, did I get, did I go past a decoy? I didn't get a decoy. So let's get rid of Zoltan, see if we get a decoy. Um, let's get rid of Vesemir. Oh boy, this is going to be a tough one, but we've got two spies, so we should get a decoy out of one of the spies. You would think. Yep, there's a decoy, and we've got... Decoyed my, decoyed my spy, you nasty such and such. Okay, I suppose I should have expected that. Okay, we're loading up. Now, you are for... <laughs> we are going to be exchanging some spies here, obviously. What are you for? You are for ranged combat. Okay, right. Um... As long as you're not siege, that's what I care about. Okay, got pretty much all our special cards. And now I could win this round, couldn't I? This would be 16 and I'd be done. But I only need 13. Oh, if only I had an eight siege. You know what I could do? Because I've got the Yen Medic, I could do this, two of those plus him. That puts us at 10 cards each and I won the round. So, let's do it. Or I could do the tie, but they win the tie, right? Okay, there you go. A little bit of overkill, but I won. So there you go. And again, I've got Yen as the Medic, and plus I get another card. Maybe I'll get my Medic card here, and that would be nice. And I can call them back. Now I got another... That's okay. Siege. Got it. Now, they once again, they win the tie, so I've got to force him to do something here. Um, let's put down Crimford Reaver. And hopefully he only puts down a card worth like three... Ah, six. Damn. All right, well, that's fair enough. At least it's not a tie here. Um, at least I don't have to worry about that. And I forced them to put something down. Okay. Um, we're going to pass. 
and he doesn't have the leader card that, or she doesn't, have the leader card that nullifies my leader card, which is nice. That was, that was tough. But I've got to worry about Scorch, do I not? All right, Ren Vuris, okay. What do I, I, Yen is my only um, ranged combat. So let's get to that right away. Let's get to, see if he's got clear weather. Green Farn, okay. And let's get Roach down. Is it Roach or is it Roche? Okay, that's not so good. That's not good at all, actually. That's unfortunate that I don't have a clear weather card. Okay, so. That puts a bit of a damper in my plans, does it not? Okay, now do we get, we're still worried about Scorch, so I'll tell you what, let's just get to um, shooting ourselves in, in the foot there. I just, I don't want to put down these guys if he's got Scorch, right? I'll wait till the last minute on them if I can. Hold out as long as I can. Uh, what's that there? That's a spy. Ooh, that's not good news. Not good news at all. Okay, so what can we pull? Can we pull a spy out? Do I have a spy? In the... No, I do. of course I don't. Why would I have a spy? That would be, like, helpful. Okay, um, is it more helpful to pull him out and boost them? Or pull... Hmm, I think he's more helpful at this point. Right? Because then he's gonna... No, he's not gonna boost anything else. Ooh, ow, that hurts. But it goes down to one. Ha ha ha. Okay, so now we put this down. I know you have Scorch. I just know it. Penetrable Fog again. All right, so that's crap. Hmm, do I do the Dandelion? No, you know what I do? I use my leader card. So let's put the leader card down. He's passed with four cards. Or she's bad. I keep thinking it's a he. It's she, isn't she? Okay, so we just rub it in then. And really crush her. I guess she figured she just didn't have enough points to catch up. Okay, so there you go. We get her card too. Very nice. Feeling much better about my I prospects. How I lost that. Oh, I believe this card belongs to you now. How many other players willing to stake rare okay, cards? Still going. In Novigrad, Siggy Rubin's collection is famous. You really should challenge him. <sighs> That's a problem. That is a major problem. Well. They say you took a mound of coin for helping catch that sorcerer. I guess we know what we're doing now. I guess we're playing Gwent with Siggy and killing Radovid. 